Hey everybody, it is All Girl Plans and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a plan with me for the week of July 12th through the 18th. Um, this week was actually Shark Week and I had this, I had like a couple ideas for what I wanted to do for this spread. Um, and then obviously uh, my ex and I broke up um, after, like I planned this after we broke up. So I didn't want to use anything like super lovey or any of that because it was already going to be hard enough to plan anyways because um, we did spend the first two days of this week together and then he did go back to work. But um, yeah, I saw that it was Shark Week this week and I had this kit from Glam Planner. Uh, it is, I think this is from like 2019 because there's like a calendar thing and it says July 2019 on it. So yeah, but I don't I don't really care. This was kind of difficult to plan with. I did have to bring in a lot of different extras, not only because it was a busy week, but also because um like all the little things were red and there this was like a pretty old kit, so there just wasn't as many labels as I am used to. But I did like I think I've said this multiple times this week was a week where like if I did an extender for every time I needed one, I would need one every day. So, um I ended up not putting full boxes on every day and only putting them on days that I would use an extender for. Um, so it was just kind of like a weird spread to film, um, like a little bit more complicated, more brain work. So I did not pull out every single sticker for the day by day that I needed, um, partially because I just wanted to get this over with. And then the other part was like privacy stuff. So I hope you guys can forgive me for that. It's going to be like that for this spread as well as the next one. And then after that, should be A-OK. -okay. Um, the next spread that comes like after this one is the week that we broke up. And we broke up on a Tuesday. So um, the rest of that week was, I think, I don't know. Like, I don't want to say it was like easier to plan because I was really, really sad. Um, but like, I didn't have much to do with him. It was more me, like, by myself kind of stuff. I don't know if that makes any sense. If you've been through a breakup and you've had to plan it, then you understand. And if you've been through a breakup and you've had to plan it on camera, then you probably understand even more how difficult it is um, doing this. Because obviously, like, I know that I'm sharing my relationship and my life with, I don't want to say the world, but the world basically, because anybody in the world can watch this video. But it is just harder being that vulnerable in general, but doing it on the internet is a little bit more difficult. Um, but I know you guys are really supportive and have been there for me through this breakup, and I really appreciate that. So I wanted to continue to plan this on camera. This is just the way that I was able to plan it, so it's weird. Um, also, I think in the last uh, voiceover, this is so funny, I'm pretty sure I said that I was dating this guy, and like two days after, like, he wanted me to be his girlfriend. He decided that he didn't, he wasn't ready for a relationship. So, um, yeah, I've been single for a little bit and that's also why I haven't really like uploaded anything. Um, not only because I haven't had time, but because of that. And my life is honestly just kind of an, um, profanity ahead, uh, kind of been a shit show. Um, I got into a car accident yesterday in real time and now I'm just even more stressed about money than I already was, so that really sucks. Everybody's okay. Both of our cars, um, like, the other person's car is, like, barely damaged. Um, my, the front of my car is, like, I don't want to say, like, really, really damaged, but it's, you know, damaged. Um, and, yeah, it's just, it's a lot of anxiety and very overwhelming <laughs> and then now there's like more financial stuff that I have to worry about so yeah I don't know I'm just kind of a mess right now but I want to catch up on YouTube and do my planning stuff and try and eliminate any stress and I've been so stressed about the fact that I have so many videos filmed that I just have to edit and upload so I'm gonna see like about doing all of that that way I can take them off my phone I need to go through my phone and delete a bunch more pictures um, because like last night I just got really, really sad looking at pictures and like I was talking with my therapist about this, but like I'm like, it's not that I miss 
Tom, it's, I'm like upset about, I don't know, like I get sad thinking about the good times or like that I like, I don't know, just, I don't want to go into like the ends of the relationship, but I was looking at it with rose colored glasses thinking that it was amazing and parts of it were good, but yeah, I guess I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. But let's talk about the base. I didn't even talk about that. What the heck? So I'm using hollow and sparkly hollow with bits of blue and red foil. Like the red, white, and blue basically. Uh, to match the colors of this kit. And I had some Sadie stickers like 4th of July stuff that was red, silver, and blue. So I also brought some of that in. Um, and you can see me here. I'm doing like the glitter headers. I put down some silver or some sparkly hollow or just hollow. I, I think they're just hollow actually. Um, underlay boxes from Sticky Essentials. Um, it's that tape that I'm actually using to hold down one of the box extenders. Um, sorry for my hair too. I really need to get it cut. Um, I was actually gonna schedule my haircut yesterday and then I got in the car accident and now I'm just afraid to spend any money. So like I have insurance and all of that but like my deductible is still, I still have to pay that you know and now I'm just like terrified. Um, so excuse my hair is basically where I was going with that. I'm kind of all over the place and I'm sorry if this voiceover in this video isn't wonderful but yeah I put down the bottom washi and I kept it all together because it had those sharks there and I just thought that was really cute and yeah I don't know like what else to say like for the glitter headers I used some like sparkly hollow ones put those on all of them um for the full boxes there were some that came in that little Sadie stickers um, like foil pack that I got. I got that like two years ago. And then for my, like I didn't really like the date covers. I'm really like specific about ones that I like. And I wasn't a big fan of the ones that was in this era of Glam Planner kits. Uh, so I did some sparkly hollow date numbers and then some sparkly red date cover days. I don't know, like just days of the week from Chasing Chels. I do have a code for Chasing Chels. Um, I also have one for Sticker Guru, Plana Hannah, um, Mini Riot Co., and Nicole Alexia Designs. I believe those are all of them. If not, I'm going to feel really bad. Um, let me just double check. Do, 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 do. Yes. So I will have all of those listed down below as well as any shops that I use regularly. And I will try and say where stickers are from. Um, like I said in the beginning of this video, I didn't put down stuff for every day. So you won't get to see that until I post it on Instagram. Um, but I am like actually finishing those spreads. I just finished putting in all the other stuff off camera for uh, the homecoming week. And it looks really cute, honestly. <laughs> like, it's a really cute spread. Um, yeah. And I went through finally and put in like my habit tracker stuff for, I still have to put in my sidebar stuff for like the rest of like my past spreads. Um, I moved over like half of the year into a different planner, actually the one that was from last year, um, because my planner was getting really chunky. So I moved all that and now like just, I have what, from like May on in here, or maybe it's April. And I just have to like fill in the sidebars still, but I'll get around to that eventually. I'm getting close to being caught up. Um, I saw that my like moving kit from Delilah shipped, so I'll be able to plan that for you guys um, whenever that arrives, which I'm really excited about. And yeah, I gotta like pick out my kits by myself now, which is kind of weird. I kind of hate it. Um, but it's fine. I picked out the next week's kit, the Nightmare Before Christmas one by myself. Um, so obviously I know, and I did it before him. It's just weird, you know, going into, going back to how things were before. I don't, I don't know. It is weird. But, um, yeah, I don't think I did my date cover, or my glitter header overlays or any of that on camera. But now we're in the day by day. Um, I've been like playing around with my lighting and like trying to edit it to make it like a little bit brighter. Um, so I hope that the quality looks better. I don't know. And so let's go ahead and get to the day by day. Like I said, I had to pull in a lot of different labels and stuff from like leftover kits and um, like multicolor that I've had or 
and like different foiled boxes like I just had to pull in like a lot of stuff um, to make this work but I feel like I did make it work so I'm pretty excited about that uh, the first thing that I marked on Monday um, was actually some cuddles so I used a once more love sticker and then um, I have put in some of my stickers off camera I haven't finished this week's but I can just like tell you guys like if I have put it in what I put in so I ended up using a cuddle script from Plana Hannah from her red foil bundle and then the next thing I marked was that it was like a rainy and stormy day so I marked that with a Coffee Monsters Co little like rainy sticker and I used a Please Stop Raining sticker from Plana Hannah. I actually don't really mind the rain, um, but it was raining like a lot. And we wanted to go to the outlets. So um, thankfully it stopped raining by the time we went to the outlets. But yeah, we went to the Round Rock outlets. Um, he wanted to just get some like clothes and stuff. And we both ended up getting two pairs of Vans and a bunch of like t-shirts and stuff. Um, got some like pretty good stuff. Uh, and I used a Whimsical Cat Studio sticker for that. And then we got Starbucks when we were there. Um, I got like a coffee and we shared a grilled cheese sandwich. It was really good. Um, just to hold us over until dinner. And then we had some cuddles when I got back to my apartment. Just kind of like hanging out um, while we were waiting to go to a culinary dropout with my family. Um, well, with my parents. Um, because... He and they like they wanted to meet each other so did that um, pretty sure that's a coffee monsters co sticker maybe it's either coffee monsters co or once more with love I can't remember um, and then we went to this like pub that was at the domain used a paper and milk sticker for that and then uh, we watched some ghost adventures I used this little ghost sticker from once more with love and then I marked that it was like a night at my place because that was like the only time <laughs> that I really like stayed over at my apartment. So I used a happy day a sticker for that. Then moving on to Tuesday, I woke up um, a little bit early so I could go and get groceries because I wanted to make coffee for him. So I used a Sadie stickers little icon and I ended up using a groceries script from Sticky Essentials. And then this was the day that uh, we filmed the boyfriend tag um, for my channel. So I marked that. I had a therapy, um, like virtual, so I marked that with a Once More With Love sticker and a therapy script from Plana Hannah. And then we did go to Pluckers. Pluckers is like one of my new favorite places. Um, I really like it a lot. And there's one that's like kind of close to my apartment area. And I know the bartender there because whenever I go somewhere by myself, I always sit at the bar. And... He's pretty cool, so that's nice um, that I, like, know somebody there so it's not as, like, awkward. Um, and then we did go to Ikea so I could get some furniture for my apartment, and then he wanted to get a desk, um, like, for gaming and stuff. And he found that, and I found a good bit of stuff for my apartment. And then uh, he ended up, like, putting it together. Um, and then I used this, like, little flat lay box. I'm not going to go into that. And then with that, like, crazy face sticker, I marked that, like, on the w the drive back to his house, like, we just had so many laughs. We were having, like, just such a good time. Um, so I wanted to mark that. And then we got Taco Bell um, right before we got home, and then we shared that. And then cuddles. Um, and then Wednesday, he did go back to work. So um, marked that. Ended up using a Tom script and then a work script and this little military munchkin. And then I did do laundry. He let me do laundry at his house um, before I left because I have to go to like a laundromat to do mine. Um, and he was like, oh, why don't you just bring it over here? So I did that. And I used an Olive Studio laundry basket sticker and a laundry script from Sticky Essentials. Then I marked that I was just really in my feelings. I was really sad that we didn't really have that much time together when he got back um it, it kind of sucked so I marked that with a fox and cactus girl and then I got back to my um apartment and I cleaned everything got ready and like rearranged a little bit because we had built my table and I had to move my stuff around so I could put the table in the kitchen and then um we did end up like facetiming 
for a little bit. Um, I went to Wendy's on my way up to get my oil changed. And, oh, am I getting like a little bit ahead? Um, I used a Wendy's script for Murdoch Talks and a Fox and Cactus Girl. I hadn't had Wendy's in a while, um, but it's towards, like, it was like on the way. Oh my god, Abby is sleeping. She's so cute. Oh my god. My little guinea pigs are so adorable. But, um, yeah, I got some, like, chili cheese fries and some nuggets. It was really good. And then I got my oil changed. Um, marked that with the Sadie stickers. Um, like, blue and silver sticker and then I did go to Home Goods and Target because there's one that's up in Cedar Park that's pretty nice um, and it's like right past where the place I go and get my oil changed is so that's pretty nice use the Sadie stickers foiled icon for Home Goods and then a munchkin for Target and then I did pick up my TV from my parents house this day because Tom was gonna try and help me put it up and then Ended up not being able to. My dad ended up helping me, though, in the end. So that was cool. Um, and then the last thing I think I marked was that I called Tom. Let's move on to Thursday. I feel like I'm handling this pretty well. What do you guys think? <laughs> so, Thursday. The first thing I did Thursday was a face mask and then wash my hair. I have, like... A pretty solid routine down for Thursdays it's like my well it's my Sunday so it's the day before I go back to work and I do my baking that day and I do any sort of like self-care stuff that day so I used a paper and milk Maru to mark the face mask and then a Cough the Monsters Co sticker for washing my hair I think here I'm like putting like a full box in because like on one of the I think a couple of the extender days I ended up like not needing both boxes I think it was just like Sunday and Saturday um so yeah I did that uh and then I did clean tidy up a little bit so I used a munchkin and then after that I think I like what did I mark I didn't even film it Maybe calling Tom. I don't know. There's a couple of these boxes in here, so I need to figure out which ones each of them is for. But I did plan and film that day, and I did some baking. Um, did I do all of my baking that day? I think I did, yeah, because Tom didn't come over until the evening. But I did some baking. I marked that with a little cake sticker from Once More Love. And then we called, and Tom did come over. And then we took a little nap, and then we woke up and went to H-E-B to get some sushi. And I had to get, I think I had to get maybe some other ingredients. Yeah, I had to get some groceries and, like, some other ingredients and stuff for baking and just for life, I guess. I don't know. Um, yeah, so I we got some sushi there, and it was pretty good. Um, he really liked sushi. I really like sushi. I you know he still continues to. And um, I hadn't really given it too much of a chance. I had it like a couple years ago. Actually like four years ago now. On a really bad day at night. I was like forced to eat it and I didn't like it. But we got some stuff there and some like pot stickers. And we dipped the pot stickers in Chick-fil-A sauce and it was actually pretty good. But I think I was convincing myself to like it for him because I ended up getting the pot stickers and doing that um, on my own like maybe a week ago or something like in current time and I didn't really like it that much so I don't know but I got to use this little sticker from Carly Plans to mark our little sushi date and then we did start watching Shutter Island and I finished my baking that night that's what I, that's when I did it um and I loaded my dishwasher and then Tom and I did FaceTime to bed because I really missed him um because he was gone for so long and then went back to work and yeah, I don't know. Moving on to Friday. Friday was my friend Ilza's birthday. Um, so I wanted to mark that with a Once More Love sticker holding a little cake. And then my period did start um, late Thursday, early Friday. So I marked that there. Um, hmm. And then I got Starbucks, and I was in my feelings. 
I wrote down here that his phone was dead. Um, oh, I remember this now. So, like, we FaceTimed to bed, and he didn't have his phone plugged in, even though I told him to, and his phone died. So I left to drive to go and wake him up, and then he ended up waking up when I was halfway there. Um, so I got Starbucks on my way home from doing that, and then I was just kind of in my feelings. Um, and then I filmed a voiceover, and then this might be TMI, but like I used a tampon for the first time. I've always used pads because I was never like taught how to use a tampon. And then I saw a video on TikTok and I was like, oh, it doesn't look too bad. Um, so I got some and I used them and I actually really prefer it um, to using a pad, especially because like I am really busy on my work days and I can't use the bathroom just like whenever. Um, so that's like really good. I don't know. And I can wear like shorts and skirts and not feel like I'm wearing a diaper. I think that's like the main reason I like them. And then, um, yeah, then I called Tom, had really bad cramps, did some planning and filming. We FaceTimed before I went to work. Um, and then I just had some sassy customers and I was in a lot of pain. So I just was like, and it was a little bit slower. So between all those things, I was just like in a meh mood. So I used a little like kiss my butt, um, sticker. Sorry. I just like, I was sitting crisscross applesauce. And I just took my foot down. But um, to mark work, I used these Nicole Alexia Designs, like, scallop circles. And then a Fox and Cactus custom girl that she made me a couple years ago. And a work script. And then I'm going to use an Atomic script as well. Um, and then on Saturday, we did FaceTime in the morning. I was, like, super in my head after that. Um, and I used a Once More Love sticker. And then I did go to Walmart before work because I had to get tampons that were, like, more for, like, heavy duty, you know? Because um, I didn't want to get those to start off with because I was kind of scared, honestly. So I used this Walmart bag. And then I did go to work. Um, I was in my feelings. Um, so I used a Fuck Today script from Planet Hannah. And then it was really busy. We got Modern Market delivered. So I had, like, a little pizza, I think. Um... And then we did call, and then we kind of FaceTimed to bed. Um, I think he, like, had gone out with his friends or something, and, like, I don't remember him calling, but when I woke up in the morning, we were on the phone. So, yeah, I don't really know. So we kind of FaceTimed to bed. I just don't remember ever answering. And then on Sunday, I did wear, like, my Beetlejuice outfit, which I did post on my personal Instagram. I love wearing those shorts and doing like a Beetlejuice, like black and white stripes outfit. And now I have black lipstick. And But that day I wore green lipstick, actually. It was pretty, co pretty cool, pretty cute. Um, but I used this like Fox and Cactus girl to mark that. It's like one of her girls that's watching like a scary movie, but it has black and white sheets. So it made sense to me. And then um, we FaceTimed. I got Starbucks. I worked was not feeling good. Um, we called on my way to pick up Whataburger for everybody at the shop. Um, or wait, no. I marked that I was feeling good, not that I wasn't feeling good. I was in like a pretty good mood. So I marked that. Um, and then, yeah, like I said, we called on my way to pick up Whataburger for everybody. And then um, I went to Casa Chalupa with um, Sean, who's the person I normally go to Trudy's with, because Trudy's was closed and we had Pluckers, and then we went to Casa Chalupa, and then we ended up going back to Pluckers. Um, because Casa Chalupa just wasn't that good. Um, the service wasn't really great, and then our food, like, everything was a little more expensive, but smaller portions and wasn't really that good. So just all around wasn't really a good experience. And I left early because I was getting really anxious and just really sad. And I wanted to go and see Tom, um, but he wasn't a fan of me, like, coming because he had to go to work the next day, which, you know, is understandable, um, but I was really sad, so I just went to bed really sad, yeah, I don't know, but, um, that's pretty much it for this week, I'm surprised that I was able to talk about all of that, I hope that, um, this was still entertaining to watch, I know sometimes I can be really sad and really honest, um, and that might not be, like, the most pleasant thing to hear, um, but I hope that you still enjoyed this, I really appreciate you clicking on this video and watching it, um, I hope you guys will stick around and I will see you guys in my next video. Take care.